What's up guys, it's Astriel, and today we have a new banner. Should you summon for Christmas Alexia? Damn, she has some nice assets. Two very big assets. I'm talking about her skill 1 and 2. Come on guys, she's a blue DPS in the mid line, and her ult lowers the defense of a single enemy. I know the banner says she's an AoE that lowers defense, but her ultimate only lowers the defense of one single enemy. Her skill 1 however is an AoE that damages the enemy and lowers the defense within 200 centimeters for 10 seconds. And for her skill 2, she does 200 damage on all enemies within 100 centimeters of the target. And she gets a special passive where if one of your party members die, all damage will be increased by 15% for all blue allies. So if you sacrifice a unit, you get an extra 15% damage for all your blue units. Her first awakening increases that damage to 20%. The second awakening increases the duration of the debuff on the enemy's defense. Her third awakening adds another magic gear slot. Fourth awakening increases damage to her second skill. Fifth awakening increases damage to her ult. Her kit is like Sid and Ida combined into one unit. Sid does an AoE ultimate, while Ida lowers defense. For the main quest, she is pretty good. Especially if you're a lower player and you're just starting out, you will face against a lot of enemies where you have a type advantage if you use the blue team. However, if you work on your Sid or Ida, or if you pull for Epsilon or even Delta, you don't need her. For the main quest, I would give her an 8 out of 10. For PvP, she is amazing. She lowers the defense of all the tanks in front of her. However, her skills will not reach the back targets such as Beta or Gamma, so it won't affect healers. For PvP, I would give her a 7.5 out of 10. And for Battle Royale, I have not reached that part yet so I have no idea what to give her or how to use her. So. Should you summon? Well, it kind of depends. If you pulled for a tank but you were lacking DPS, you could summon her. But if you pulled a healer and is lacking a tank and DPS, no, don't summon. I would suggest you pull a tank first. But keep in mind, you do have Sid, and if you level up Sid, he will perform just as well. If you pull for someone like Epsilon or Delta, you don't have to summon her. As of right now, gems are a bit limited, so I would suggest you save for the really strong units, like maybe Atomic Boy. I am Atomic. By the end of the day, I really like her design and I like her looks, and Alexia is one of my favorites in the show. So remember, pull for her if you want because waifus over meta. I would appreciate it so much if you guys would just drop a like and comment on this video. It gives me motivation to not shoot myself every day I get out of bed.